Britain's last military flight has left Kabul late on Saturday after evacuating more than 15,000 people in the two weeks since the Taliban took control of Afghanistan and the nearly 20 years of British military presence in the country. On Friday, Britain had said its evacuation mission would end within hours and that its military would be unable to fly out any Afghan citizens eligible for resettlement who had not already entered Kabul airport. British Prime Minister Boris Johnson said in a video released on Sunday that all remaining soldiers, diplomats and civil servants have now left. As I speak, Sir Laurie Bristow, Her Majesty's Ambassador, has finally boarded one of the very last flights from Kabul. All remaining soldiers, diplomats and civil servants have now left. We will engage with the Taliban, not on the basis of what they say, but what they do. And if the new regime in Kabul wants diplomatic recognition, or to unlock the billions that are currently frozen, they will have to ensure safe passage for those who wish to leave the country, to respect the rights of women and girls, to prevent Afghanistan from again becoming an incubator for global terror, because that would be disastrous for Afghanistan. And we will use every lever we have, political, economic, diplomatic, to help the people of Afghanistan and to protect our own country from harm. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.